Jimmy Cook's perception of the artistic potential in waste wood first manifested as a hobby, but it quickly became a passion that led to a professional career creating Aspen Craft Bowls. The one-time owner of a Colorado hardware and lumber store, Cook liked to hunt for timber fragments that were unsuitable for milling and had been left in clearings to decay. Over years of weathering, a process called spalting leaves permanent dark stains in wood grain. Two kinds of fungus get into the wet channels in the wood, they die, and they leave the beautiful staining. Jimmy considers nature a co-designer. He gathers distressed woods and uses a chainsaw to refine their shapes into bowl or vase-like forms, taking into account all of nature's variations. To ensure the wood is strong and stabilized, he soaks each roughly formed piece in a solution of wood penetrant and epoxy. This step also retains the natural color and eliminates any further insect or fungus activity. Next, he uses a lathe he made himself to turn each piece. He refines the insides to the same smooth finish as the outsides, then evaluates where turquoise inlay would augment the elegance of the wood form. He fills these indentations and crevices with turquoise and sometimes coral inlays. The turquoise can be in the form of solid stone, powder, or chips, depending on how it will be most visually effective. When the exterior turning, interior routing, and semi-precious stone inlays are complete, Cook finishes all surfaces with urethane varnish. Jimmy Cook is quick to remind collectors that he never takes a burl from a living tree. His amazing ability to see the beauty and reveal the organic integrity of what otherwise would be waste raw material has attracted individual and institutional collectors around the country.